Oh no, you're gonna. Oh, you do a lot of damage to me. Oh my god. Hey everyone, welcome back to another episode on Ark Survival Evolved in Extinction, and today we are gonna go be we are gonna be going and finishing off the Forest Titan. Um as far as I'm aware it's still alive and it's just sort of roaming about the arena that it sort of spawns in. It can't leave that area. And based on when I went back to go and get my stuff, it doesn't despawn on your death, and I'm assuming it doesn't despawn until you actually um until you actually kill it. So we are going to be going ahead and finishing it off with a Rex Rush just because we don't have the resources required to rebuild a mech and all its ammo and what we're going to do after this is in a later episode or next episode we're going to try doing a bunch of orbital supply drops and hunt down another upgraded mech um, unless we get one from the Forest Titan itself uh, we might get an upgraded mech, I'd assume we're just going to get like upgraded components rather than an upgraded mech, but if not, next episode we'll be doing like a orbital supply drop run, uh, we might try a purple one because we haven't tried those yet, but I think um, um, unassembled mechs will spawn from like red and purple, or will drop from red and purple, so those are the ones that we want to be doing. And yeah, so we are just collecting up all the Rexes. Um, I've had them out so they would heal up. And we should be able to take out this Forest Titan real quick, no problems. This should be a nice, simple, quick episode. The only thing holding me back is the Rex's tails that won't let me cryopod them. But we'll be back when they are all cryopodded up and nice and safe. Honestly, I don't think I actually need all of them, so I'm probably just going to take one hot par worth. Um, essentially and yeah I don't want to lose my none of that stuff so we will do that and then let's move oh, we do that and then we want water oops food and then the spyglass right Oh, actually, because we want the main Rex as well. Uh, we'll, we'll take this, we'll put this one back, whichever one I'm holding. Lob it. Uh, I did do an orbital supply drop off camera, so I think this has some stuff with it. But I think I picked up everything important off of it. Um, actually, no, because those legs are quite nice. Uh, don't really other stuff I'm not too worried about but let's go stick these materials in here we'll stick the legs and we'll stick the sickle in there and then I just want my snow owl which did have some stuff as well um, I want you over here. and then let's grab man I'm not as prepared as I thought I was let's get some of this stuff and then I think if we just consolidate element dust that should be fine and then let's stick all that in there, we don't need that either okay I think we're good so we're going to take the snow out, we'll teleport over to the forest and then when we're over there we'll go over to where like the arena bit is and then we will start releasing our rexes main reason I'm just doing it in one sort of like hot bar worth is just because it's going to be easier and quicker to get them all released um, where do I need to go? I think it's like this direction. I'm sure it's like just up there, literally. Oh, 
Or is it here? Or it could be here. I don't know, I can't remember. I think it's around here. I'm just not sure where exactly. Obviously the awkward thing being that it might not be here anymore. The only time I saw it was when I went back for my stuff. I have done a little bit of off camera work. I did an orbital supply drop uh, among some other things. So it could despawn over time, although I don't believe it does. Okay, I think this is it. Where are you at? Do I need to respawn you? I feel like I might have to. Yeah, because this is where I jumped off the cliff. And then I went and died like over there. So, okay, so it must be on like a timer then. It must despawn over time. Okay, right. Well, we'll have to go back through the cave and do that. I do have an artifact at the base and I need to go and get the trophies from the base and then so I'll go and grab all of that stuff go back to the cave uh, which I just can't remember which direction I think it might be this way ish I guess that way and then when I got all that stuff I'll be back when we're back in the cave right so we are back and I got everything that I need so I've got the corrupted hearts sauropod vertebrae and T-Rex arms, I'm literally just bringing all the ones I had of each. You only need 10 for the summon, but you need different ones for each boss, so you might as well just bring multiple. And then I've got the artifact of the growth. So I'm going to release my Rex. We'll cryopod the snow owl. We'll still keep the snow owl with us, because once we're done with the boss, we're going to need the snow owl to get back to the base a bit quicker. So we may as well keep that with us, something we learned from facing the first Titan. And then we'll jump on Rexy and we'll do this cave. I've done this cave a couple of times on camera now. So if you want to see me going through the cave in whole, go watch one of my other videos. There's one, um, like the first video I have on getting the artifact of the growth. And then there's one that I did last episode, which was defeating the Titan. Well, like trying to defeat the Titan with the mech, but that one, bit of a mess. And I went backwards and forwards in the cave and... Um, that's a little bit less clear, so I'd recommend just doing my Artifact of the Growth video. And that'd probably be your best bet. But yeah, I'm just going to go through this cave, and then we'll cut to when we get to the teleporter. Alright, we have made it to the teleporter. I'm just going to go stick in all the trophies and the Artifact. But we are just going to run up there to go and grab the Artifact that's just across the way from the teleporter. Can't grab it before... Um, you put your artifact in because you can only carry one artifact at the same time and I have a bunch of stuff that's weighing me down unrelated to me grabbing the artifact but I thought that'd just be worth pointing out so let's go grab the other stuff or let's go grab the other artifact although thinking about it I could just stick it on a Rex probably or stick with the one I'm carrying on the Rex and then get the artifact on my way to the teleporter and then I'd already have it I don't know I'm rambling all right I'm just grabbing the artifact nice and quick nice and simple and then we will just drop off this cliff and then use the nice little dismount trick so we don't take full damage oh. And then aggro everything that would aggro on me. Because I've dismounted from the Rex. Oh, and there's a Polovia. Oh, and there's a Capro. This is the worst this has gone. Please, 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 please. Hey, Rex. Thank you. Oh, yeah, that was by far the worst that has ever gone. Usually that works a bit cleaner. Maybe just do a little bit more crowd control if you're doing that in future. And kill a bit more stuff before jumping off and dismounting. 
do we want to get rid of anything else? Just do a bit of weight management before going in there. We don't need normal meat at all. I don't really need the arrows. Let's be honest. I'll keep the trophies and I'll keep the resources. Um, yeah, the other thing to note as well is that if my Rex can carry it, my Snow Owl can because my Snow Owl actually has a lot more weight. Not a lot more weight, about 200 more weight. Two to three hundred more weight. But, yeah. Oh, actually, yeah, while I'm here, obviously, we might as well get the rest of my Rexes out. So we'll do this, we'll activate the teleport while we'll be at the boss and we'll defeat the Forest Titan in no time. After the Ice Titan I have absolutely zero lack of faith in my Rexes. I haven't brought as many Rexes as I did with the um, Ice Titan but I don't believe I'll need it. We shall see. Just drink some water, eat up. Let's go, let's go. Alright. What? Fully mutated Rexes versus the Forest Titan. There you go. There we go. Let's get him, boys. An attack. An attack. No, you don't want to do that. What, what are you guys doing? There we go. There we go. Yeah, we got it. We got it. Just come on. No, there's some that still aren't attacking. It's almost half health. Just Rex rushing with fully mutated Rexes. Seems to be the way to go with the Titans. I do want to go back and try and take them all out with a mech though. I feel like that'd be really cool. Oh, are you going to do my little dismounting thing? Maybe you can't if I'm at your feet. Oh, no, yeah, you still can. Oh, no, you're going to... Oh, you do a lot of damage to me. Oh, my God. Right, there we go, we're back. Right, so I need to run away if he starts doing his little vine grab thing. Which I don't think he will, because I think we've done it. And we have Tech Sword. Oh, okay. So I've had a Tech Sword that I wanted to craft for a while now. And it actually seems like I wouldn't have been able to actually use said Tech Sword. Um, so that's interesting to know. What are you all doing? Wait, I've got a Forest Titan head. I'm positive I didn't get an Ice Titan head because I spent ages looking for that thing. It must have been in a Rex bag that I didn't look in. Uh, what am I looking for? I'm looking for health potions. I know I have them. Medical brews, that's it. Do a bunch of those. I want to take on one of these. Whoa, where are you all at? No, no, no. Um, I want to whistle passive just keep that whistle going just so I know that I'm definitely in range of them whenever I hit him are you one of the wyverns I don't want to see if you drop anything interesting oh there's sulfur not really a lot of prime meat though but yeah that is the forest titan let's go and grab all of our stuff back and then we will head back to the base 
teleport, we'll head back to the teleporter, which will teleport us back to the base. I'm carrying a lot of stuff, so I'm very heavy right now. Oh yeah, I broke a lot of armor. Well, I didn't break it. Titan broke a lot of armor. That tree grab was very dangerous. It's just sort of the lack of dismounting. The lack of dismounting? No, the lack of being able to get back on your mount to protect you. And those stomps. To be fair, I'm surprised I even tanked some of those stomps. Managed to tank two of them. Very sketchy, very, very sketchy. So, yeah, that was actually more dangerous than the Ice Titan, just based on that grab. Oh, I didn't mean to pick that up. Eh, I don't really want any of that. I didn't mean to pick that up either. Just picking up a load of poop. I just want to make sure there is nothing interesting in the bags that I might miss out on. Nope. And we just got two left to go through and double check. And then we will cryopod the main racks. Ooh. You know, I'll take some fungal wood. I don't mind a bit of how does a rex get fungal wood? It doesn't gather from trees. I'm assuming it's from like the toxic trees that the Forest Titan spawns, but that just seems like a weird mechanic that they'd be able to farm those, but not normal trees. Um, right, let's get you cryopodded. Now we'll walk the snow out over to the bag, just because it'll be an easier transfer then, uh, which is that bag. Mr. Rexy, or Mrs. Rexy, I don't even know, is it a boy or a girl? I always lose track. I don't really care about those. Definitely want that and that. I don't definitely want all of that. Right. Just get all the heavy stuff out. Why am I carrying the poop still? And then grab you, you. Grab all that prime meat just because it's nice and tasty. And we want it and the rest of that can blissfully stay here to despawn and be forgotten about by the world all right let's go uh which way am i going i'm gonna go this way all right so i'm gonna go over to the teleporter we'll head back to the base and then we'll call the episode there and boom at the teleporter let's go back home And we're back home. I'll just get my thing back to the base. Oh, I could do some inventory management off camera, but let's just double check all the stuff we got. So that's some armor that broke. I actually don't need you. Pretty sure I don't need you or you. I probably should have checked that before chucking. Tech rail guns, those ones are not that great. I'll take you. I do have another shield module, but I can't remember. Um, oh yeah, no. So I want that in my inventory. I want that with me. Um, so we've got some ammo. We've got some rocket pods. I would have liked some cannon shells. Cannon shells are what I'm planning to use. That seems to be the most effective thing to use. So that's a shame. Um just some trophies, the artifact okay I didn't really get anything massively nice because I think from the ice titan we managed to get an upgraded shield module and an upgraded cannon last time um, so yeah that's a shame let's go check out the stats on the other one uh, where are we at? there we go 31.3 33.2 so that is actually a better one so we'll take that one, we'll drop that one uh, there is no craft limits, so that's good as well. And yeah, I think we'll call that episode there. As I said, next episode we'll probably just do a orbital supply drop run 
and not just one will sort of edit together a bunch of them in the hopes of getting a upgraded unassembled mech and then we'll use that mech to take on the desert titan because i don't know for sure but i'm pretty sure that is the only mech that i can't just not mech i'm pretty sure it's the only titan i can't just rex rush if there is a decent opportunity to do so and if there's like something we can stand on or whatever that would actually allow us to hit the desert titan because the desert titan is something that flies i don't have any really good damage dealing flyers so I can't just rush it with something and I think the mech is going to be my best option at the moment if we can um, but yeah we'll have some rexes with us just in case there is like a place that we can stand and actually take it out but that is going to be it for this episode so if you did enjoy don't forget to drop a like and subscribe to the channel if you're new and until next time see you later